Hello there, you guys. Welcome back. I'm so sorry for the slight delay there. Uh, I think Twitch is being a little bit twitchy today. I think I saw you guys in chat noticing some missing badges and such, and it's been twitchy on my end as well, so that's that's great. It's a good start. <laughs> um, but how's everyone doing? Welcome on in. Uh, happy Tuesday. It's Tuesday, right? I'm pretty sure it's Tuesday. Um, the shirt. Yeah, I don't know where I got this shirt. <laughs> I, I was looking through and I'm like, I don't know what I'm going to wear today, and then I saw this and I'm like, when did I get this and why have I not worn it ever? So, yeah, Evolution shirt today. Um, plans for today are we are going to be spending a lot of time in memory today. We're going to be doing our dailies first and foremost, and then second off we are going to be working on our encyclopedia because I didn't realize we had like such a long time to wait for New Horizons, so. We now get to work on that. <laughs> uh, Merman, thank you so very much for the host of I actually have come up with a list of every single fish, deep sea creature, bug, and uh, painting that we need to finish the museum. We've already finished the fossils. Um, so yeah, that's going to be fun. <laughs> um, other than that though, if Twitch wants to be nice to us today, I'm going to switch over to City Folk later on, maybe two, three, two and a half hours later. Um, but I guess we'll have to see. Um, I'm hoping that it wants to be nice, because I've, I've already seen a couple issues happening in other people's chats. Also, <laughs> uh, Ashpash and Ast Astrantic? And wait, I'm not saying that right. Astran Astrantic. I'm saying that wrong, I think, but thank you very much for the follow, the both of you. <laughs> I'm so sorry about that. Um, but yeah, welcome on in for those asking about uh, Tiger. He is okay he's doing better um it's not looking so great on the long term but i'm still actually waiting to hear back from the vet they were supposed to call me this morning and i still haven't heard anything from them so i'm hoping silence is good and not bad <laughs> um but if not i'm gonna have to uh go take him back in probably tomorrow um just going down i'm yelling mixer <laughs> oh gosh uh, I guess I had a lot of issues on Twitch, the chat. Yes, no, I've been having a lot of issues this last week, I want to say, on Twitch. Whether it be chat going down, um, hosts not popping properly, just everything under the sun has gone wrong. Um, emotes and badges are missing, like... Hopefully, Pepper, hopefully. <laughs> but welcome on in. There's a lot more of you than I'm used to in here right off the bat, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to go through and say hello to absolutely everyone. So I'm just going to say a really big hi to uh, everyone in here. I'm so sorry. <laughs> is Tiger, is it your pet? Yes, Tiger is my cat. I've had him since I was eight years old. <laughs> and I'm 25 now, so we've been together a while. Uh, and he is he's my old man. <laughs> Is Nightbot working? Nightbot seems to be working, so that's good. Um, we have Nightbot. <laughs> Love this shirt. Thank you! I wish I knew where I got it. I honestly don't remember buying it. I have no clue when it came into me in my possession. I don't know if I've ever worn it on stream before, but it's heckin' cute, so... <laughs> Didn't know Tiger was so old. He's very, very el elderly, which is why health issues are a little bit scary. Who's talking to me? Midge? Let's turn over under gameplay here. Just the type of flower you prefer is a reflection of your personality. Sure, why not? <laughs> uh, a loving the Amiibo fan beside you. Thank you, thank you. I have them all lined up. Those are all the ones I actually own for Animal Crossing. I'll just in case anyone didn't see them. Uh, Lottie is kind of getting cut off, like right over. I can't even reach that far, but she's getting cut off a little bit. But it's okay. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna say a sunflower. Sunflowers represent optimism and loyalty. That's great because you can accomplish anything with a positive out- sorry, attitude and hard work. She looks fab. <laughs> oh wait! Oh, you're right, she does look fabulous. I just realized what she's wearing. <laughs> also, Cece, with that 15 month resub. Uh, new record- insert new record sound from Mario Party Games. I like how you come with your own, um, your own sound effects. It's beautiful. Thank you so very much. Love and chat. You guys are already doing it. I don't even need to say it. <laughs> oh, gosh. Well, that makes me happy, Midge. 
Mitch is best verb. Can we just all appreciate that for a second? Also, it's raining in memory today. It's very gray and kind of gross. I hope that this doesn't affect the fish I want to catch. I know bugs sometimes don't come out if it's raining, I think, but I don't know if it bothers fish. Hell, you're married? Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't play Splatoon 1, so I don't have much opinion. <laughs> Only played Splatoon 2. Uh, do I have any spare hybrids? Um... Technically, yes, but I'm not giving any out at the moment. At the moment. Flies have bloomed on the bushes. They have. I think that happened on the 15th. I believe. I think that's when that, that changeover happened. I don't think it really affects fish. No, it was. Uh, thank you very much for uh, being understanding about that, Ryan. Uh, it looks awfully similar. You actually sort of like the rainy weather. I don't mind it. It's just I hope it doesn't bother our plans for today. You just talk about birds without Ark. Ark's not here as far as I know, so... Also, Dragon Knight, thank you very much for that follow. Very much appreciate it. Also, Pikmin Lover with the two-month resub. <laughs> just ignore this, and hi, how are you? Thank you, thank you, thank you. That's confusing. I swear it just came up yesterday. Anyway, it's fine. Um, <laughs> and there's, there's the dance for Dragon Lover. There we go. I read them in the wrong order. Okay, so we got a couple presents. Let's go check out this stuff. Ooh, stylus. Uh, thinking of gyros after it rains is the worst part? Agreed. Agreed. Especially when you're like, you're looking for your fossils and you keep thinking you're gonna get it. Uh, quite skull. Hello, how's it going? When you abandon memory, we need to uh, blast the past stream in like two years. Oh, 100%. 100%. We'll start doing something like that. Like a throwback. Thursday at some point with just memory. <laughs> uh, Dear Crystal, look what I found. I saw a TV show about these things. They say they're really popular in Japan. Anyway, I thought you might like it. Bob, speaking of Bob. <laughs> uh, Animal Crossing fanboy, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. Oh, I'm just gonna open this up. Uh, <laughs> wait. That would fit Bob so well. What does that look like? That would fit Bob because that looks like his furniture set. Oh, that's crazy. Oh my goodness, and little Lavender, you guys are like throwing the love on me today. I'm not ready for all this. Uh, thank you for the three month. <laughs> Thanks for the great students, looking forward to more. Thank you so much for being here and being a part of them. Um, you guys are already putting love in chat. I'll put in a little bit more. Apparently we're having a sub train and I'm like, my body is not Reggie for this. So just so you guys know. Um, ooh, what? So Crystal, congrats. Congratulations on your win since you turned in the most praiseworthy bug during the bug off. This prize belongs to you. Magnificent from Nat. So we actually did win the bug off. So that's exciting. I'm gonna save that letter. Taking an hour to the knee. Actually tipped. Oh, tripped on the bottom of the stairs and hit my knee. I'm falling apart. Oh, Pepper. <laughs> oh no. We got the gold bug trophy. That's exciting. Okay, Sammy. Oh, Nisa, is it tomorrow? So it'll be during uh, Mario Kart then, I think. So Crystal, how you doing? Made any friends? Eating enough? Your mom is always worrying about you from dad. That's different. You don't usually get letters from dad. Was that for the Father's Day thing? It was. It was. It's okay, right here. Uh, Marina or Pearl and why? Um, Marina, because I like her hair. I don't have very many opinions on Splatoon, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, better get ready for the 24th. That's the birthday of this town's very own idol, me. I'm throwing a party, so you better be there. Okay, so Blue Bear's having a birthday on the 24th. We'll save that letter as well. So Crystal, ta-da, I got you a surprise present. I wish I could be there to see the look on your face. You'll just have to tell me about it later. I hope you like this. Sincerely, Cube. Okay. Let's see what Cube got us. Palace wall, very nice. That's kind of cool. Okay, I'm just gonna toss out letters that I don't. Keeping that one that I don't. I'm also keeping that one. Oh, I'm keeping all of these. Gosh darn it. <laughs> Have a crossing leaf town a while ago. Such a blast. I don't think I'd be enjoying it this much. I'm glad that you are. That's fantastic. I know a lot of people are restarting because of the um, New Horizon news. So it makes sense. Uh, Nintendo Plus? It depends. It depends. I don't- what day is the 24th, you guys? Hi, Max. How's it going? 
Love you, hello. Thank you. Do you prefer villagers you only like normal? Normal are my preference as well, but I'm cool with either. Um, so I guess I'm just gonna put this trophy over here. Is it Monday? We're probably not gonna stream that. That we're we're streaming uh, po uh Pokemon. Oh my goodness, we're streaming uh, Kingdom Hearts that day. Is that trophy the wrong way around? Wait a minute. Oh my god, it was the wrong way around the entire time. Both of them were. That's embarrassing. Fix it. <laughs> Hi, cool boy. Hope that they change the one save file per console limit. Fingers crossed. Um, the try six is Wednesday. I'll be okay. Okay. Um, so we got a carnation. Ooh, this is from our slumber party. And I'm gonna sell these. Run into two flowers. Oh, they were so pretty. <laughs> Stop playing Animal Crossing Leaf because they thought we were getting Animal Crossing on the Wii U. A lot of people, yeah, a lot of people did. I didn't stop per se, but I did get a Wii U for that reason. Which, man, I kind of regret that now, not gonna lie, but it's okay. It's fine. <laughs> not salty. Where'd I get the rainbow item? Uh, that's a good question. I'm not sure. Where did I get that rainbow thing, you guys? I think someone gifted me that. Uh, oh, who gifted? It was one of the mods. I don't remember who, I think. I could be wrong. Favorite KK song? Uh, KK Cruising at the moment. It was from Pepper. I thought I was- I was- in my head I'm like, Pepper Arc, Pepper Arc, and I'm like, I- I think it was Pepper because it seems like a Pepper thing, but... I don't know. <laughs> oh, Mongala, please be safe with that. That's not good. Is this? Hello? Well, come on in. I'm sorry if I'm missing people coming in and I'm missing saying hello. There's a lot more of you than there are of me, so please do be patient. Sanrio Amiibo cards is where Pepper got the, um, rainbow. It's a very Pepper thing. <laughs> That's snooty. Um, do you like Amiibo Festival or Happy Home more? Amiibo Festival, if I have to choose one or the other. 100%. <laughs> I know that's gonna be controversial, but I really don't do the whole interior design thing in Animal Crossing. Uh, Breezy Flowers has just resubscribed using Prime for six months. <laughs> Half a year. Thank you so very much. Thank you, thank you. I hope you uh, continue to enjoy being here, enjoy the emotes, all that jazz. Um, and thank you so much for the continued support. The gasp. <laughs> Ooh, Colton. I haven't spoken to you today. Spills tea. <laughs> I forgot about that. I think my room's aura is all thrown off, and the horse mackerel is to blame. I'm pretty sure I got that for you, but okay. It's cool. I'm gonna go to the island and make some bells. Or rake in the bells, I guess you're saying. Perfect. Just luck with your island adventures. Uh, deals yesterday I ran to a tarantula twice and spent 10 minutes. See, you could- some people might call you lucky, others would call you unlucky for that. It depends on if you're searching for it or not. No tea, no shade, just pink lemonade. Uh, is it just me or does the color blue fit cold? No, I agree with that. Lemonade, you enjoy your ramen. You enjoy it. Oh, you know what, it's raining. It probably won't make a difference if I water these. Other day retail had tarantula for extra bells. Oh no, why would you ever meh it sounds scary to hunt for them? Do I have plot reset paths? I mean I did for a little while, but I've taken them all up now because all my villagers are in the places that they're staying. Um cool. Alright, so we got two fossils. Um, but yeah, if anyone who's just joining us. Um, I did explain at the beginning of the stream, but I'll say it again. Um, we are going to be doing our dailies in memory today, making sure everyone is all happy and good. And then I'm going to be working on our encyclopedia, so things like fish, bugs, uh, works of art isn't really counted, I guess, and deep sea creatures. Um, I'm going to be trying to complete the ones that are available during this current month and our current time that we're streaming. Um, and I guess we'll just see <laughs> if we can. 
Have you found a single tarantula, but of course in my other town was the one of the first bugs you caught? Yeah. No, I feel that. Uh, Dark Angel Artist, hello, how's it going? Okay, Q wants an ocean fish. Uh, so let's go grab him one of those. My ears pierced today, I've been trying to lie down for half an hour, forgot how uncomfortable. Ooh, gosh. I've never had my ears pierced. Um, or anything for that matter. I really, really dislike the whole idea of it. It scares me. Hi, Liz. I'm doing good. How about you? Uh, Ark and I think Forest. Hello. How are you guys doing? Welcome on in. I'm sorry if I'm missing people. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm my best. Uh, I noticed we don't have the curving world anymore because they finally mastered depth of field. <laughs> yes. A lot of people are saying that they don't like it, though. They think that everything looks really blurry in the background. Eating some McDonald's? Oh, Liz, I caved last night and I had McDonald's as well. I had a rough day yesterday. Um, but what what, what do you get, more importantly? Um, Liz, thank you. Uh, Demon Zero, hello. Just came home from your graduation celebration. That's cool. Awesome. I hope you guys, or I hope you, I guess, in general, had a good time, but everyone else as well. Okay, let's see what this is. I know that's the point of Death of the Field. I know. People are just, they're complaining for the sake of complaining, I feel like. Chicken nuggets and McDouble with no onions. Oh, Liz, you're speaking my language now. <laughs> uh, who is Camille? Am I saying your name right? Thank you very much for the follow. And, oh my goodness, Liz. They stopped offering that where we are. Mike and I, we, our go-to for McDonald's was, was a McDouble with Big Mac sauce on it. And they stopped offering it. I'm so sad. Also, Jimbo, how's it going? <laughs> Welcome on in here. Nearly, how do you get villager picks? Uh, so two ways. You either befriend them, it slowly but surely will happen, or you play on April 1st and go through the April Fool's Day event and hopefully get their pictures that way. You also went to McDonald's last night? I think it was just, it was one of those days, you know? We're gonna have McDonald's tomorrow before our movie. Ooh, very nice. Very nice. Uh, cube, I have your fish. Please take. <laughs> HML, can you imagine? Uber Eats doesn't deliver McDonald's to me. I I don't know what I'd do in that case, because I'm lazy. I'm lazy and I like having it delivered to me. Don't know what I'll take, though. It's always changing. I feel that. That's cool. I'm boring. I like to get the same thing every time if I can. Alright, Cube is gonna give us something wallpaper. Is it wall? Stop talking about McDonald's, I'm hungry. Oh, you are in the wrong stream for him. No, um, we talk about food like probably an unhealthy amount here, fair warning. Um, you you will get hungry. Lots of snacks. <laughs> Oh my goodness, Steven, thank you so very much for that sub! Thank you, thank you! Dragon Knight it is, indeed. Love and chat, you guys. Love and chat. Um, I hope you enjoyed the emails. Thank you so very much for just joining the little sub club we have going on here. Um, you guys are honestly spoiling me today, and I'm like, I'm not mentally, like, here fully, so I feel kind of bad that I'm just not, like, freaking out. <laughs> Jimbo, you speak in my language as well. Self made brownies, he's talking about food. Oh my goodness, brownies, heck yeah. I really want to make cookies or brownies with Mike this weekend, but I am trying to eat healthier. <laughs> Not going so well. Followed your playthroughs on YouTube for a while, you're a great person. Thank you, thank you so much for that support, you have no idea. Uh, it's Jade, it's Jade Mo. Am I saying your name right? Welcome on in. <laughs> I'm glad you enjoyed the videos and thank you so much for checking out the Twitch channel as well. You may be going through a rebrand. Ooh, ooh, tell me more. I was gonna go check out your Splatoon stream this morning, Liz, but I didn't get the chance. I was a little bit shy. I wanted to join in, but I didn't know if you like splat with anyone or if you have like a team or... I'm bad at Splatoon as well, so... <laughs> but I still kind of had that urge to jump in with you. Oops, hello. Do you get those bushes on the island? Uh, I think most of them are from the island, yeah. 
Least favorite native fruit? Uh, oranges. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> oh, no forest. Uh, Bob in my town so I couldn't miss out. Oh, yes. Bob is best. <laughs> Make healthy brownies by putting spinach in them. Oh, Max, that just does not sound good to me. <laughs> Jade, Jade Ammo. Okay. Okay, awesome. Welcome on in. I'm so sorry. Ah, uh, let me see. You're trying to keep up with chat. Narwhals and unicorns since this black vest, and I was really loving the whole vibe of narwhals being different and mystical and magical. And I think you're basing the channel off narwhals and the whole theme. Stay gnarly. Oh my god, I love that. Do it. I want to see it. I'm down for this. Oh wait, is Katrina here today? Is that what Kevin's telling me right now? Cause that's cool. Also, where did this come from? Oh, I think these two... Okay. I'll take it. <laughs> I want to change it all, but then I don't. My emote artist already sent me samples in our wall emotes and they look so good. I Maybe even just integrating it slowly might work and then like, you know, seeing how everyone takes it. I love the idea though. Uh, Soccer Gamer, hello, how's it going? So on TV they were saying that everybody needs a signature greeting. Ooh, is it Eric's time to have tip something, you guys? Why, why, why does he have Tip's beak? He stole that from someone. <laughs> That's the issue with having everyone say, every everyone saying Tip's antlers. Okay, I don't know if I have room for it, but I'll, I'll give it a try. Oh. <gasps> Done. Another truck. <laughs> he stole it from Midge, yeah. <laughs> tips beak and tips antlers, Kevin or sorry, Eric, I think you're confused, buddy. Oh. <laughs> Hi Farblees, how's it going? Love Eric so much. He's a he's a fantastic villager. He's probably on one of the ones that fits this town the best, I feel like. Uh, Soccer Gamer, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. And Ignited Fox, hello, how are you doing? Astrid, you know what? I don't know if we gave you that or where you got that from, but this looks actually decent in your house, so <laughs> we'll go with it. Uh, Lee, I think you need to pass four in total. Which, by the way, Gracie was here yesterday, but I didn't do the fashion check off camera or off stream because I didn't want to do it without you guys. And now I'm like, it's gonna take us forever for her to come in on days that I stream. <laughs> CW, hello, how are you doing? I remember that you have an exquisite wall. I've been looking for one of those for a long time. Did you bring flowers in Animal Crossing on GameCube? I don't think so, from what I remember. Astra works out, she's super small. <laughs> Oh no. Fish and Astrid's room is a whole mood. I didn't even notice it there, honestly, but now I can't unsee it. <laughs> what day do I stream? I stream every day at 2 p.m. EST. Um, my schedule is going to be changing soon to be an hour earlier, just to get myself used to streaming for longer periods. Um, but at the moment, every single day, 2 p.m. EST. Um, if you're curious what day or what games I stream on what days, you can scroll down and my schedule is right just below you guys. Reward events to stream and put them on YouTube. It's tempting, but it's just it it's doesn't have the same interaction, you know what I mean? And I went in order three packs of evil cards. Oh my god. <laughs> you enjoy those? I hope you get whichever villager you're trying hard to get or villagers. Is there one in particular you're trying to get, or you're just wanting to collect them? Happy Crossing, very nice. Um, gosh, another gyroid. <laughs> Great, okay. So, oh, Katrina is here today. We can go over there and hopefully not have a sink or anything heavy dropped on our heads again. Hi, Duckling, I'm doing pretty good. How about you? Soccer Gamer, for sure, you're more than welcome to. Mm -hmm. 
Rich is yet? Not at all, not at all. We've only really just begun. We're just kind of doing our daily stuff. Still being whether I should buy seven Animal Crossing Amiibos or not. Do you mean like the Amiibo figures or cards or... I'm trying to tips fridge. <laughs> tips sink. Who is the owner of this home? It's decorated so nicely and I see four happy figures, not my house. The one who stands in their midst, the smiling vision of you, it's not my house. <laughs> if it's decorated nicely, it can't be me. I don't do that. <laughs> it's actually a cute item though. Sorry, getting too late, dude. I'm part of the Animal Crossing card trading group. Oh, that's awesome. That's great. Two weeks till summer vacation for you. Awesome. I hope you have a fantastic time off. No worries, Pepper. Take your time. Brooke, hello. How's it going? Blood dress. Yes, you go, girl. <laughs> Tiger, okay. Um, he's not in the best shape. Um, he is a very old cat. And it's something I have to be aware of, but at the same time, he's um, he's a lot better than he was uh, two days ago, I think it was now. So I'm still waiting back to hear back from the vet about testing and stuff like that, but I guess we'll, we'll see. <laughs> I'm supposed to get a call back this morning, but haven't heard anything yet. Okay, that's a little burb right here. It's Father's Day. You might not be able to say thanks, Dad, every day, but make sure you tell him so today. So that was two days ago. Uh, wall-mounted monitor, and we won the bug off. Cube came in second, and Gaston came in third. That's a very big difference between second and third place, though. Uh, Purple Sapphire, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in here. Uh, place you want my dreamies for someone new, but I can't decide. Ooh. There's a lot of choice. I didn't realize how many villagers there were in Animal Crossing until I was, I was going through them earlier for something else. Hi, Dagger. How's it going? Uh, let's see here. No one gets bronze like Gaston. <laughs> Poor Gaston. He's trying his best. Also, did our tree get larger? Or is that just... I can't tell if it got larger if it's just like the... Um... The leaves on the tree. 333. Is there really? A lot of villagers. App Animal Crossing New Leaf Guide. I've heard so many people who who use it. I think I used that one. It was it was a new leaf app and it didn't work really well for me, so I haven't really looked into it again. Um, but I already have all my encyclopedia stuff written out. I actually have a list this huge spreadsheet uh, document with all the fish and bugs and all that jazz that I need to finish my encyclopedia, so I'm going to be following that. <laughs> um, let's see here, so we have- oh, no, don't, don't do that, misclicks. Three fossils, we need one more. Clever, thank you. Thank you. If you want to uh, use them or if anyone else in chat would like to use them, I think you can type in exclamation mark path uh, to get the link to the QR codes for these ones. Um, as well as these, I th think I could be wrong on that one. But <laughs> I think I included them somewhere. I also need to shorten those links because those are ridiculous. <laughs> It's a long link. That's actually two links. That's why it looks so bad. Mubot doesn't let you really have um, proper spacing or anything like that. Do you ever intend to stream Smash Ultimate? Nope. Not really into Smash at all. Um, don't dislike it or anything. I'm just not really into fighting games. I think the entire series is really neat. I like what it's trying to do, but not really my jam. St. Crystal, in three quarters of your time, you'll be hearing a shovel you crafted. Uh, whenever I hear, like, you're gonna craft something, I always am concerned that there's gonna be some sort of, like, durability on it, and we're gonna end up, like, breaking it. Just called it Mooba. I'm always calling them the wrong name because I have both still. Um, yeah, I'm missing a fossil. <laughs> That's annoying. 
I feel your encyclopedia is currently. Uh, let me show you. Let me show you. So our fish is... We're on tap. Our fish is kind of decent. There's some decent chunks, like right there. Uh, Life of GG. Thank you very much for the follow. Um, Bugs is not great at all. Um, I have barely been in the ocean, so we need a lot there. Hope your ability isn't a thing. Also, hello. Fuchsia, hello. How's it going? Minecraft when people mention crafting tools, you know, starting to am across the new horizon when people mention that. Yep. Everything's gonna change a little bit. Oh, okay. So we have our orange and we have the purple that we needed. So that's exciting. Um, let me go put these down here. By the way, I'm sorry if you guys hear the occasional strange bang loud echoey noise in the background of my mic. Um, I do have my window open and of course there are loud trucks outside. <laughs> it's raining so I can't really do much with them right now but our uh, city so feels quite different now. You know that he got made redundant. It's a little bit sad I'm not gonna lie. Um, maybe that's just nostalgia because when you think about it he technically didn't have a job in New Leaf as well. You had to make the reset center. Or else he wouldn't be in the game really at all other than the first time you reset, I think. So, it, they're kind of just cementing that he's kind of being redundant. <laughs> hey, Bear, uh, B. Ferdinand, how's it going? Second day in my town, got purple rose, very nice. <laughs> Demon, it's totally fine. I really dislike hunting them as well, honestly. I had told her really, but I don't. I think I heard people complain this much about Breath of the Wild, which does have durability. I was really nervous about Breath of the Wild's system when I first saw it, um, but honestly it was not that bad to use, so. Okay, oops, no, wrong button. <laughs> Misclicks are real today, you guys. There we go. There we go. Um... So, uh, I don't know where that last fossil could be. What's the purpose of the reset center in New Leaf? Can you talk to him or something? Yes, you can. Um, it's, I think, only after 8 or 9 p.m. I think the day after it's rained. It's it's a very specific timing. It's not open most of the time. Quite so, thank you. A cafe yesterday, but I have no idea where to put it. Think hard on it because it's not one that you can move or tear down. There's a twitchy day, yet yeah, Twitch is being twitchy, which is a little bit frustrating. But have you ever experienced coffee before? You think you would have with being friends with uh, Rooster, but. Complete your fossils last week, first time on an animal crossing game. Very nice, very nice. For me, I always, always complete the fossils very early on, and everything else I have never really done. I think I've completed the fish one once. Is unicorn? Hello, how's it going? Welcome on in. We're also doing some seafood today. If Twitch isn't being horribly twitchy, then yes, eventually I will switch over. Um, I am aiming for a longer stream today, but I guess we'll have to see. Also, I am once again waiting on that call from the vet, so if I get a call saying they need to see him, my cat, now, then uh, I will have to end things early, obviously. <laughs> uh, Crazy Unicorn, thank you so very much for the host. Um... Oh, that just came up twice for me. That was weird. <laughs> uh, Twitch is being twitchy in my country day or two before everyone else because it isn't twitchy at all. It was really bad for me. It, I think last Friday it started. And it's just been bad pretty much since then. It's just been weird in several different ways. Lego girl, you enjoy your lurk. No worries. Going back to it, I realized I did absolutely nothing on it whatsoever. Yeah, I still played it every day. Honestly, what did I do? You probably just chatted with villagers and just had fun that way, maybe?
I really wish I kind of had my original Wild World Town still. But, um, I, I had this phase where I would just constantly reset everything. Any game I had, I would want to reset it and start from the beginning. And I put it down, then I'd do it again. <laughs> uh, cage? Am I saying your name right? Thank you very much for the follow. I never played Wild World, but I played Safe Folk when I was younger. I... My knowledge of both games is they're very, very similar. It's just... One is a little bit more graphically advanced <laughs> and has a city, but otherwise they're very similar. What was the original Animal Crossing title? Um, technically, it was, I think it's translated to Animal Forest on the N64 in Japan, but the first one we got over here was Animal Crossing population growing on the GameCube. Akage? I'm, I'm saying that wrong, but thank you so very much for letting me know. I'm gonna try and remember that, hopefully. Ever had Rodney? Um... I don't think so. This event's only I'm crossing. One is massive motion controls. Japanese for redhead, that's kind of cool. And do our shopping, and then we'll go ahead and begin with the encyclopedia work. Is Rodney a kangaroo? I was imagining a hamster. I'm not sure why. <laughs> um, do we already have? I think we do. I remember this one. Um, and I'm good for all those. He is a hamster. Okay, no, see, I know. I know my I know my villagers kind of. Did we change paths? Yeah, we changed paths a couple weeks ago. I feel like maybe. Uh. Oh. <laughs> Is it? Oh gosh, I'm gonna say this wrong. I want to say Leah. I'm not sure if that's how you want me to say it. Thank you so much for the follow, and Chili Bit, thank you very much for the follow as well. Welcome on in, both of you. I'm so sorry if I'm butchering names. Favorite girl villager? Um, probably Midge, honestly. She's a sweetheart. Elsie Warrior, hello. We've been live for just over 40 minutes. We just are kind of wrapping up our dailies right now. Goliath, hello. Welcome back. How are you doing today? Bunch of work as usual, but today's... Nice day. Very nice for us. What color is your hair IRL? This color. <laughs> um, my hair can change shades depending on how much sun I've gotten, but it can go from like a darker brown to like a lighter reddish brown. No, I don't want any of those. <laughs> Leela. Okay, awesome. Thank you so much for letting me know. I'm so sorry. But, uh, welcome on in. I have a least favorite villager. Um... I don't, like, I don't really hold grudges. Per se. <laughs> maybe cat? Maybe. Uh, Vel Sparker with the six month resub. Thank you so very much. Channeling your inner link noises. I love it. Love in chat, you guys. <laughs> CC. <laughs> okay. Um, just gonna go put these away. I have a lot of uh, bushes that I've been kind of storing because I don't know where I'm gonna put them. <laughs> Snooty. Uh, official Matthew, thank you very much for the follow. That name rings a bell for some reason. How are you doing? You're having a good day. Alrighty, so we finished our dailies. Um, did we talk to- no, we didn't talk to Phoebe, Blue Bear, or Bob or Gaston. I think we're missing them, so let's go find them really quick. 
We're gonna do island tours today? No, we're gonna be doing, uh, as the title says, encyclopedia stuff. Oh, random. <laughs> Is the peach not called butt fruit because Nintendo needs to get on the Ray game? Seriously? No, I, I'm joking. I love you. But, like, still. <laughs> Got Kingdom Hearts the story so far. I hope you enjoy it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I kind of want that, but it's it's not worth it for me because I already own the games. They're just separate. But having it like that case, that's that's what I want. I'm a I'm a shameless fan. It's really bad. <laughs> Mike Tron Gaming, hello, how are you doing today? Okay, no one's in here. My character doesn't have an umbrella and just gets soaking wet. I'm gonna not- I'm not even gonna lie, the reason why I never carry an umbrella is it bothers me that my character puts it away. Which makes sense when they go inside or go back outside and they have to take it out. And it takes extra time. <laughs> I get bothered. Uh, Purple Sapphire, I tend to play- I might do a little bit of dailies off stream, but I never do anything that's like, interesting off stream, if you know what I mean. Um, so like Gracie's fashion checks or- um, handing in stuff to the museum, like I tend to save for on stream. Where, where are all my villagers? Be his merch. <laughs> Maybe one day. Maybe one day. Um, I seriously two exhibits and no villagers have been in here. Guys, we're missing villagers. <laughs> Um, Ian, there, uh, I've only finished two. Gracie was in my town yesterday, and that's the thing that keeps happening, is she comes in on days that I'm not streaming this game, but I'm streaming other games. And, um, I don't want to complete it off stream, right? So I'm just ignoring her. <laughs> so this might take a while longer than it should. Uh, Nick Fizzle? Am I saying your name right? Thank you very much for the host. <laughs> Gaston, there we go. Hi, buddy. Big bug, big bug. Wait, it's Belsie. That was rude. Oh. Oh. <laughs> because I got hungry. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Honestly, though, not sure if you're doing me a favor or not. It's okay, Beamer. No, honestly, you, you can enjoy your lurk. You don't have to feel pressured to talk at any time. You can just enjoy watching and pretend that I'm not, like, able to answer your questions or anything live. I'm a bug now, apparently, yep. <laughs> so we're still missing Phoebe. Um, Did we see Bob? We might have actually seen Bob. I think we're just missing Phoebe. Um, I hear some- oh, no, well, there's Bob. <laughs> First time I ever found a fossil, I was like, so excited I actually lost my appetite. That's a pretty scary experience. Phoebe's an unknown. Random took her. I'm going to hope that she makes it back. <laughs> but I do need her. Random, it's weird to think of you not wanting to set fire to something. Uh, Nick Fizzle, thank you very much for the follow as well. Welcome on in once again. We're gonna love Bob. Bob is somewhat worshipped on this channel, fair warning. For anyone who's just joining us, we kind of, uh... It's, it's a little bit of an addiction. <laughs> Did I pass her? Where was she? Did I completely pass her in the last room? She was blending in. So far, my panels panels panned out, and the Discord is called the Shell Nation. Oh my god, I approve so much. <laughs> or while you enjoy the Shell Nation, and you can earn shells by watching. Love it, love it. There you are. You are blending in a bit too well for me. <laughs> But you and me will- Sorry, I bet you and me will get dug up at some point in the distant future and put on display like this. I- I don't know about you, Phoebe. 
Does it feel weird to see your viewers in chat when you watch other Nintendo streamers? Um, not really. It's just like, I know you. <laughs> I recognize that username. Oh, Kaya, I don't- I'm not really the type of person to watch too much. Maybe someone else in chat has some sort of recommendation, though. Die fighting to the death. Careful, Phoebe has a shovel. <laughs> you can tell she's being a no when she says something morbid like that. Oh, boy. What have I gotten myself into having her as a villager? Alrighty, so dailies are done. We've seen all of our villagers. Everyone's happy. No one asked me to move out. Thank goodness. <laughs> Watch as someone comes up to ask me to move out. Um, and what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and start working on our encyclopedia. So do, if you guys want to see what we're working with here, I'll show you. I'll show you all the work I've done. Um, in here, where, where is it? Whoop, there we go. Behold, my work. <laughs> my homework, actually. So anything that is colored in is stuff that I can potentially uh, grab on stream right now. Um, other stuff is either after or before stream starts or just plain old not the current month that we're in. Um, so this is all the fish that we need. Every single one. <laughs> um, and then, oh gosh, where is it? There we go. And then over here, if you just kind of come with me here, these are the bugs we need. <laughs> Again, colored in ones are ones that we can grab. Um, with the scorpion being last. <laughs> and then finally, got our deep sea creatures. Um, which I've barely, barely dived in this game. So we might actually start off with that. A few then. Oh no, we got a lot. <laughs> we got a lot to catch. Uh, or fish up. And we also have, uh, our artwork, which I just listed all the ones that I am missing. So that I can refer to this every time, uh, Red comes into town. But yeah, so I think maybe we'll start off with the deep sea creatures. Try an isopod, I remember that. I remember too, trust me, I was, I was reading that. Uh, when I was writing this all down, I'm like, yep. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> But yeah, it says the name, size, and or where I can catch it. Obviously, this is like, it's in the ocean. Um, time of day, and then the months of the year that's available, so... This will be fun. Um, so if you guys are ever curious what I'm going after, you guys know. <laughs> and I'm just gonna mark it off as I uh, progress, I guess. Um, so let me go ahead and... Boop, there we go. <laughs> go back to normal. Um, let me go ahead and get my diving suit on. Diving is so much work. I've never finished the diving collection. I think, did I finish it in Rosewood, you guys? I feel like I might have. <laughs> but it was like, I had to push myself to do it because I dislike diving as well. Um, next question. Where's my diving suit? Why do I have two black diving suits? I, I'm going to wear the pink one. We're going to be fancy today. There we go. Um, and that's that's fun. You start doing the diving trick again, and then Curls pinged me and suggested something. I'm afraid he's reading my mind. <laughs> but he gave you something, right? Did he give you a good one? Also, Google Sheets to make my own list like crystals. It's very handy. I actually did something very similar with Rosewood, I feel like, but it was like on a notepad. Oh. Oh, the worst project? Oh. Okay, he wants us to buy his diner tile. Sure, why not? Uh, only one he didn't finish was fish surprising. Was it? Did I finish the bugs? I don't remember this. Wind turbine. That's not bad. That's not bad at all, actually. There we go. Alright. Why would you spend all your money on a dining tile? Sometimes you just... Sometimes things just happen. There we go. <laughs> Alright, so... I'm used to, like, going right over to the corner, but we're actually, like, properly looking for something today. This is gonna be weird. So, uh, fair warning, I'm really bad at diving. 
like really, really bad. <laughs> Sometimes you just watch too much home and garden television. Uh, Quirkson, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. <laughs> Arg. Oh. Alright, wait, wait, wait. Something right there that's actually moving. So it's not like the sea grapes, I think, or those ones that aren't actually properly. Oh, there we go. We got a lobster. Did I need that? I did. Cool. Um, so I'm just gonna, like, mark that off, I think? There we go. I'll do it like that so that I can see it personally. For new catchphrase, I'm looking at the Kingdom Hearts. Miguel yesterday. Koopo. Oh, that's really cute. That's actually a cute catchphrase. Low key. I don't hate that. <laughs> Diving ain't so bad. That was like an easy one. Uh, Tauros? Milk? Am I saying your name right? I think. I don't know how else I could be saying it, but thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. she's bad something also Christopher she's to be good at what she just said she wasn't good at and then there's do we already catch this catch seaweed you guys know what I mean we didn't need that oh well gotta make a lobster increase the fishing pay oh wait wrong game no but um I don't know I'm I'm I, I honestly, I put it down to streamer luck. I wouldn't have such good luck diving and, and Desert Island Escape and catching things if I was playing off stream, but on stream for some reason, 100% I think streamer luck is a real thing. <laughs> oh wait, I see bubbles. I see bubbles. Whatever it was, it was easy. <laughs> uh, Pearl Oyster. The need, great. I think you should swim with your rainbow socks on for increased luck. Arc, I would, but I think they take them off automatically when I put on the diving suit. Of the wetsuit. Thank you! Thank you. Yo, Alp, yeah. Um. Opposite of Mercury's Law, whatever can go wrong, won't go wrong. On stream. Actually, you know what? No. Technically, <laughs> like, behind the scenes, getting ready stuff can go wrong and will go wrong all the time. But when I'm actually live, generally things work out for me. Generally. Now that I've said that, I won't find anything that I need today. Um, Jody, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. Bring them under the wetsuit. I've just, like, pulled them up. That doesn't make sense. I'm also looking for a lot of like very small and small um things because that is actually something I needed. I'm gonna mark that off real quick. Go. So the two fish out of the corner of my eye and I thought they were merged. Not gonna lie, I thought the same thing. <laughs> You're really tiny, whatever you are. Uh, acorn barnacle we also needed. Hey, this is actually going very well. I was expecting this to be a lot worse. Just like the tarantula was that second day we tried. Oh, oh, something else. And this thing's actually moving. Okay. Don't you dare go under that rope. I hate it when you do that. No! No, that's not fair. There we go. <laughs> we jinx it now, all we'll get is seaweed. Oh, it's another lobster restaurant. This better sell for a lot. <laughs> also, Elvis... That is a year! Thank you so very much for that. Love in chat, you guys. You get a new sub badge. It's the pure purple. I purposely put the sub badge for a year at Twitch Purple because we gotta represent, right? 
So thank you very much for that. True, Merman, true. I can see that. Uh, Pearl Oyster. Uh, Monkey, hello. How's it going? Also, Strawberry Milk. I'm not sure. I'm, I'm trying to keep up with chat. I'm not sure who's just coming in or who I just haven't seen yet. But welcome on in anyone who may be joining us. We are just working on our encyclopedia right now. We just finished our dailies. A chill stream from memory today. A tiger. He's doing okay. He's stable at least. Lobster, octopus, and clams move that fast and they are the most bells. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Which is glitching for you really bad. Is anyone else having issues with Twitch? Maybe just chatting or... Gone with Tiger? We're trying to figure out exactly what's wrong, but... Beyond just him being old. Uh, we're trying to see if there's something else that might be bothering him. I'm gonna get tests back today, hopefully. It's okay, Katie, no worries. Uh, we already caught that. Robot Ninja, hello, how's it going? Welcome back. Orkies, you enjoy your lurk. I'm probably going to run out of pocket space soon. No, oh, Elvis, I have him at home with me here. And Lemonade, we will see you later. You have a good one. That's <laughs> oh, I don't. I wonder what's wrong with Twitch recently, though, because they've just been very, very just weird overall mm, did i need that i'm just gonna get rid of something that i know that i don't need just in case i did need that um we'll get rid of this one make rounds to the villagers too yeah andrew i figure when my pockets are full and i have to go back up but they might actually try and like buy or sell so Model social media seems to be weird. The only social media I really use these days, other than, I guess, this technically, was that a fossil back there? Did I just. I thought I saw a fossil. <laughs> um, I really use this Twitter. Instagram is also done earlier today, and social media has been acting weird. I wonder. What's going on there? <laughs> Okay, oh gosh, wait, no, don't sell before I know what I'm donating. That would be a bad idea. Ridge Reserve Blooming, they're my favorite bush. Yes, I think they started on the 15th and they are gorgeous. Actually, you know what? We haven't really checked out our campsite area because I think that area has alternating blue and pink hydrangeas right now, so those would look really, really pretty. Zerts are starting to take over. Simply press conspiracy time, you guys. No, actually, you know what? You know what? There's a real-life conspiracy going on with me right now, IRL. <laughs> guys, I mentioned it, like, maybe a couple of weeks ago now. That McDonald's here in Canada has introduced a new limited time McFlurry that's an Nanaimo bar McFlurry. And it's, if you've never had a Nanaimo bar, I would 100% recommend looking into it. It's really good. Um, but regardless, Mike and I have been to like so many different McDonald's. <laughs> and none of them have had this thing. None of them. At all. Ever. Like they don't even act like they have anything. And I am so sad. And I'm wondering if this Nanaimo McFlurry really exists. If there's any Canadians in here who have had it, or seen someone who have had it, let me know. Because I'm, I'm honestly starting to not believe. <laughs> Let's go sell this. Order it on Amazon. Aw, uh, monkey. I'll take that as a compliment. To beat the Pegasus Cup on your fourth try? Awesome. I know I used to have a lot of trouble with the various cups in that game. Uh, Mark Long, hello, how are you doing? You having a good one? Okay. 
ahead and oh ho, ho, that's dangerous let's go ahead and sell uh these that i don't need random moves in yesterday and for some reason the villager would always be a snooty one does anyone know why um do you not have a snooty villager i don't think that's generally a thing but simply needs mcflurry time yes <laughs> She didn't like the shamrock shake. True, random, true. I didn't. I did. I legitimately dissed it on stream. Oh gosh. Nanaimo Sunday in Quebec, but it was last year. Ooh, that sounds good too. I I need that. Uh, Guru, Guru Fu. Yoshi? Am I saying your name right? I'm so sorry. But uh, thank you very much for one, the follow, two, the sub using Prime. You could use that anywhere else you use it in here, and then you drop the follow as well. So thank you. I hope you enjoy the emotes. I'll come on into the uh, sub club and the community. <laughs> uh, Monkey, I've been told there is. I don't know what the number is, but I started to pick mine up and put them in storage, and then more grew, so. Take that as you will. I'm missing two other types of villagers. It's really weird. That's kind of different. Um, jump back in. See if we can't catch anything else. So we still need sea grapes, scallop, sea slug, uh, spider crab, and then there's also ones that we can get on the island only. Spider crab, yes. And probably, probably the thing in the ocean that would scare me the most. Out of everything that you can dive for in Animal Crossing. Uh, Man of Steel, hello, how's it going? Mm, we already got that. Andrew, it, my list says that it's available. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. This is March through April. Whoops, my bad. I forgot what month we were in. Not the spider crab down. We don't have to worry about that one. Only 275 days till New Horizon, guys. I feel that. This guy, I'm you enjoy your dinner. And let us know what you're having when you get back. Oop, this one's moving. This one's on its way. Jeez. There we go. <laughs> Gamer girl, hello! How are you doing? Ooh, oh. I need a scallop for my collection. Uh oh. Oh no. <laughs> okay, we need to we need a vote in chat, you guys. Should I give the scallop to Pascal and hope that I catch another one? Or should I hand it into the museum? Because Pascal, if you guys don't know, he's one of my favorite NPCs in the entire game. I'm seeing a lot of people say keep it for the museum. That's why you always look for this. Oh, Fuchsia, that would make sense. Jeez, I didn't know that. <laughs> Donate, you pleb. <laughs> Pascal only shows up once a day, even if multiple catches. Hmm. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna trust you guys. I'm gonna trust you guys. I'm gonna find another. I'm gonna find another. Uh, find a co. I'm missing your neighbor. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. Um, I'm gonna give it to him. He's my favorite. He's a sweetheart. He just, he makes me happy. <laughs> There he is. Oh, God. I, I'm okay. If I don't, if for whatever reason I don't catch another scallop by the end of this session, someone remind me that I have to continue looking for it later on. Hey man, how's it about you give me that scallop you caught? Um, here you go. Scram, you moocher. No, here, here you go, buddy. Here you go. Thanks, man. <laughs> I'll have to do something cool in exchange. While I'm at it, mind if I drop some deep truths on you. 
Okay, you you know, life is like an orange. I forget why, why but the point is scurvy is no fun, so be sure to eat your oranges, man. <laughs> why are you so beautiful? Consider yourself truth. <laughs> He is totally right. Just look at him with his little scallop. There he goes. <laughs> oh, okay, wait. No, no, I have to go see him. He he usually appears down here, doesn't he? Did he eat the scallops? I think so. Why is he so cute? Oh, we needed the sea slug. There we go. There's another one. Let me mark that one off real quick. Perfect. <laughs> he said orange. <laughs> Doesn't he usually swim around the edge or am I misremembering? How did I just find him? I caught a scallop so he came up and asked for it. <laughs> Pretty much. He does? Ooh, am I maybe on the wrong side? Would he be back here because that's the direction he swam off in, maybe? I want to see him swimming with his little... little thing. <laughs> oh, Mark, you know what? Uh, I think it looks amazing. I'm super excited for New Horizons. Um, I am excited to see what Nintendo does with it in the next nine months because I don't think it's anywhere really close to being done. There's our second scallop, so I don't have to worry about that one anymore. <laughs> there we go. No, you have to, that's exactly what we're doing today is we're trying to uh, work on the encyclopedia. I want to see him again. He's so cute. <laughs> oh, there he is. There he is. Look at him go. Oh my god, you are the cutest thing in the world. Just, oh, his little feet. <laughs> he gets me every time. Oh, that has to be our stream thumbnail, by the way. Why are you the cutest thing? Can you talk to him? I don't know. Actually, I assume not because pressing A in the water seems to be moving forward. Did he just disappear on me? I think he just disappeared on me. I will never know. But I'm pretty sure you probably can't. Oh wait, no, wait. No, you can't talk to him. He's like, yes, I got it. <laughs> oh wait, he's not holding it anymore though. It's okay. You're a cutie anyway. He probably already ate it. Oh, Max. <laughs> he is just the sweetest NPC in the world. He's just such a cutie. Okay, let's see. We're still looking for sea grapes. Uh... Oh, gosh. The octopus, spotted garden eel, which is island only, chambered nautilus, and the giant isopod. So, that'll be fun. He already ate it, you have to follow him pretty quick to catch it. It's adorable when he does. Oh my god. Next time. Pascal be the thumbnail? Pascal has to be the thumbnail for this stream. Like, that's just, like, mandatory. If I don't put him for the thumbnail of the stream, someone yell at me. <laughs> someone tell me off. I wonder how the museum is going to work in New Horizons. What I'm assuming, and this is just my personal theory, is you do obviously don't start off at the museum, but eventually you have the chance to build it and invite blathers over. And then you can start handing in fish and bugs that you can catch around there, just like you could normally. But I think you have to build it yourself. Maybe. Will there be a next time of you diving? I don't think we're catching everything today, so. Each meal, I plan on it. I plan on it. I went to the horse shoe crab so I never have to dive again. Ah, <laughs> oh, Gamer Girl, it, 
it looks just different than what I'm used to. I'm used to a very specific looking clock. Like if I pause, it's always kind of looked like that and it just, it doesn't. Um, it's not like I dislike it, it's more so it's just getting used to it. But then again, I didn't like the look of New Leaf when I first saw it, so... It'll just take a little bit of time. Ooh, it's quite large, whatever it is. Ah, uh, that seaweed, we didn't need that. Tommy or Tim was just walking around town. Um, I think he was carrying a flag for the multiplayer. That's what I saw, at least. Um, how about this? I'm kind of just looking for the sea grapes at the moment. <laughs> Would I get used to change is best to find the new adventure? Exactly, exactly. And I know, I know I'm gonna like the game. It's Animal Crossing. I haven't really disliked a main series title just yet, so... Oh, there you go! <laughs> he saw his little nose go over the horizon. Hi, Alex! How are you doing today? Welcome on in. Really tiny. Are more common on the island, I think, at least for me. I can head over to the island because I'm assuming I can still catch things like the octopus or whatever there, right? Tiny section of the nook phone, but it's just enough of the nook phone for me to be able to see the time. Oh, like the whole thing comes up? Yeah. I'd like to see them work a little bit more on the nook phone itself because to me it just looks very empty right now. Not just, like, in terms of apps, I mean, like, the overall display looks kind of empty. <laughs> no worries, Nelly. how are you doing? There we go, there's the sea grapes. Awesome. Oh, and we don't have any room for it, let's swap it out for something else. Alex, I'm doing pretty good. Um... A little bit tired today, but it's okay. August creatures are on the island. Awesome. So we might actually be able to catch a little bit more than I thought we would be able to. Okay. Let's go hand in the new things that we caught and sell off anything that we don't already have. Oh, snazzy. Yeah, no, it, uh, it definitely showed a lot more than the trailer did. Oh, Zeniko, thank you! <laughs> thank you. It's uh, still a bit of a work in progress. This town only has um, roses, or it's supposed to only have roses, tulips, and lilies in it. Um, I'm excluding any other type of flower, but you might see the occasional one here and there that I just haven't picked up yet. Just don't- I keep doing this. I keep running to retail before I want to sell, before I want to donate stuff. What? I saw you saying you want to play Desert Island Escape in New Horizons makes me think that they should change it to like City Escape or something like that where it's the complete opposite. <laughs> okay, not at all. You have a fantastic day. Okay, let's go donate this stuff and then I guess we'll head on over to the island and see if we can't catch any more. Nice to have shops in the town. Like, you mean not like a separate screen? I could see that for sure. Um, it almost feels like it's going back in the day, but I don't really mind it too much. Nope, not assessing fossils right now. Uh, so we caught three new things. What have we caught? Like six things so far? That's not bad. Very close to the fortune teller shop. Um, I've lost count. <laughs> I've lost count. I, I think we are, but I've been saying I think that we're close for like the last two, three months. So I guess we'll see. Um, I know that we're above ten visits at least, but... <laughs> Desert Town Escape where the village... Villagers escape the New Leaf Town. Everyone's abandoned. 
Oh, Max, that's too close to home. Too soon. <laughs> Still have all this stuff. Uh, what did he give us? He gave us a ship cannon. Oh my god, I'm gonna keep that just because that's cool. Not gonna put it anywhere, but... The possibility that we may be able to choose where the shop's building gets placed. That's... That's what I'm looking forward to. <laughs> that is really what I'm looking forward to. Okay. Um... So we caught a whole lot of stuff here. Um, I'm gonna nip on over to the island and see if we can't catch... Some more stuff there. Oh, that was a snail. I thought I heard a flea. <laughs> uh, Thrasher's Gaming, hello. How are you doing today? Still love guests on his catchphrase, whoever came up with it in chat. Oh, I lurk. Best catchphrase for guests. Oh, that's pretty cute. The New Horizons trailer will have a specific fruit for the island, like the town's in New Leaf. Um... I hope so. I can't see them getting rid of it because that's been a thing for a little while, right? Popular town into a mini shopping district. That's, yes, that's exactly what I'm thinking as well. Like, put it at the back of town, almost. Down through YouTube, which I love for your nice video. Well, Thrasher, thank you so much for checking out the Twitch channel as well. Come on over. Rosie or Biscuit in any town before? I think I've had Rosie before, but it was very for a short amount of time. Uh, Gianna, hello, how's it going? This would be unique to the island because in the Treehouse gameplay I've only seen apples, no other fruits. Was it still apples in the trailer as well? I can't really remember. I know it was in the Treehouse, but... Also, I love when you're coming from a rainy main town to the island, you can slowly see the clouds and the rain disappearing. Odd reaction to someone wanting to use your services. But you know, apparently he also kisses his reflection in windows. <laughs> He's trying his best. I need more oil. <laughs> I, uh, I want to start off with peaches again, but that's just me. I don't miss is nothing except all the glitches in Lego Harry Potter games, but to be fair, they didn't make Lego Harry Potter. To be fair. <laughs> Alrighty, so. Welcome to the island, you guys. I haven't just gone on X Factor already. I'm not used to being here during the day. Oh, this music is strange. I'm used to the nighttime music. What is this? Raining your town too? I was actually watching a couple of their Animal Crossing Daily streamers before I went live, and it was raining in all of their towns as well. <laughs> I don't know what's going on there. Um, but guys, what I want to do now is I want to go on a quick uh, BRB break. I'm going to get up and stretch. Uh, if you guys are heading out now, that's 100% fine, but thank you so much for hanging out with us. If you enjoyed, please do consider coming back and hanging out with us again. Um, if you guys are staying, please enjoy the pictures of my cats while I go on break. Uh, I will be back in about five-ish minutes. I just need to get up and stretch and grab a uh, fresh drink. So, yeah, five minutes, you guys.
Hello there, you guys. I am so sorry for the delay. I actually just got the call uh, from the vet, and Tiger is... Oh, it, it, it's bad and good news, but I'm happy. <laughs> um, gosh, I'm emotional. I am so happy that everything's gonna be... It, it's looking better than I thought it was. <laughs> so that's always good. Um, long story short, for any cat owners, um, the number one killer of adult elderly cats is kidney disease, and he has stage two. Um, they thought that maybe it had progressed to stage three. It hasn't progressed. Um, but he's still not eating and drinking properly, which uh, they're a little bit concerned about, and they want to have more testing done tomorrow, so I have the joyous task of getting up really early, stuffing my cat in a carrier, and taking him to the vet again. <laughs> um, because they want another urinalysis, and... Uh, unfortunately, the scary uh, C word, aka cancer, is coming into play here, and that's a little bit scary. <laughs> but um, it hasn't gone to stage two, and at the moment, that's kind of our main thing. So, Tiger's gonna be at the moment okay. It's just he needs to start eating more. He's he's lost about a pound recently. So, um, but yeah. Anyways, um, back to Animal Crossing. I'm so sorry if you guys are just joining us and you're like, who is Tiger? What's happening? No, welcome back. <laughs> um, Island, we're searching for the remaining, um, uh, da -da -da, what am I talking about? The remaining deep sea creatures. So I can show you guys again here. Um, whoop, there we go. You guys can see it a little bit better there. Um, so... We have a couple things that we can catch. We still need to catch the... Actually, we caught the sea grapes. I need to mark that one off. Give me a second. There we go. We caught the sea grapes. Um, spider crab we ca can't actually catch right now, so I'll mark that one off as well. Um, octopus, spotted garden eel, which is island only. Uh, chambered nautilus, and the giant isopod, which is not what I'm looking forward to. Um, tiger has the eye of the tiger. <laughs> But yeah, my baby, he's- oh, guys, I've had this cat since I was so tiny. He's been with me for every single move, every single school change, every milestone in my life. <laughs> so he's kind of an important part of my life, so. How old is he? Tiger's turning 17 in October. He, uh, he's an old boy. <laughs> um, yeah, we're gonna be catching these. Um, is there anything else? Like, could I catch, like, the horseshoe? Oh no, that's not- could I catch, like, any of the other ones, maybe? Not because of the times, though, I guess, right? Never mind, I'll just catch these ones. <laughs> uh, hope my cat gets that age. I've lost one of my cats. Yeah, yeah. Jacob, I feel that. Tiger was actually hit by a car when he was much younger, and thankfully the damage was not severe, because it can be a lot worse. Alright, <laughs> there we go. I'm happy. There we go. That's, like, a huge weight lifted off my shoulders. I was just like, am I just gonna have to worry about him? And <laughs> then I suppose give me the utter creeps. I feel that. I feel that. Um, oh gosh, where's my game? There you are. All right, back on the island. <laughs> this music is very joyous. I like it. Never had a cat, but I wild one for a long time. They are a huge commitment. Obviously, they don't kind of take the same care as dogs, but they're still... You know, they're still a very big emotional and financial and everything sort of commitment, but I, I couldn't recommend getting a pet enough. Um, just so much joy, so much unconditional love, or nearly unconditional. If I stopped feeding them, they probably would leave me, but I'd probably leave too if someone wasn't feeding me. <laughs> oh, there we go. We caught the octopus. Okay. So that's one thing that I needed, so I'll mark that off real quick. And this is quite large, whatever it is. Seaweed. <laughs> dogs that don't... Oh, like cats? Yeah, no, 100%. It wouldn't be fair on the dog or on the cats to mix. Wanna cuddle with your baby tiger? Gosh. He, uh... He's my baby. <laughs> Very much a proud cat mom. Spot a garden eel. We needed that also. That is an island exclusive, so that's really good. Uh, now all we're missing is the chambered nautilus and the giant isopod, so that's great. 
Huge shadow that's fast. Yes, I remember. I think I caught it on I on stream uh, a long time ago in a very old. Uh, I don't think that's it. In a very old town now, I think. I have a dog, but she's ancient and loves cats anyway. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> Can you catch some of these all year at the island? I mean, technically the ones that are available, I think in like June, July, and August, maybe? You can catch at the island all year? I'm not sure. Oh gosh, is that it? That doesn't look that big, but it's moving fast. I really dislike diving. <laughs> That's a lobster. Guy who bought our guinea pigs from when I was younger, he had like 10 guinea pigs, 7 cats, and 2 dogs. <laughs> that sounds like my old house. My, when, when I was younger, we had a lot of animals in the same house. Cat likes to annoy my dog and steal his food. <laughs> Gonna be changing the city folk the stream? I plan to, I plan to. I just want to work on the encyclopedia first. I'm aiming for a long stream today, so... Uh, if you're wondering why I haven't switched over yet, that would be the reason. Thing your Sims 4 for pride content, that's very cool. Is that, like, legit content, or is it, like, custom content? If you don't mind my asking, I don't really know the whole scene with the Sims 4. Three dogs at most. We've had four cats at once. Um, oh, is this it? That might be another lobster. Um, I've also had two birds. I've had a, lots of fish. <laughs> uh, one guinea pig at a time. Uh, a couple different mice, a rat, hamsters. We had a lot of animals in my house growing up. Official free content? That's cool. That's cool. And Galaxy Kitty, how are you doing today? Welcome on in. Tiger is 17. How old are you? I'm 25. I'm 25. Another one of those. We didn't need it, but okay. <laughs> I learned to drive. I can get mice. I'm an adult, but it's still her house. That's fair. 100%. If you're an adult and you're living with your parents still, it's still their house, their rules. Gosh darn it. I hate diving. <laughs> um, so I 100% get that. Also, give me a second here. I just realized I never switched back to this screen. There we go, perfect. Sorry for new Animal Crossing music. I am, I am. I've already been listening to a whole lot of fan interpretations on YouTube, which is really exciting. Of what the soundtrack could sound like. And some of them are amazing. He is collaborating with the It Gets Better project and making Pride content for The Sims 4, The Sims Mobile, and The Sims Free Play. That's amazing. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not the biggest fan of EA, but I appreciate that move. That's great. 13, I'm 21, so now I have feels to grow up with your pets. Yes. Uh, the cat... I had two cats uh, growing up. Um, one passed when he was 21, the other one when she was 18 or 19, I think. Um, and they both passed when I was 8 and 9. So I grew up with those cats. and It's, it's weird, it's weird. <laughs> New KK songs? Yes, that's gonna be exciting. I don't know if I should bother. Oh, you know, I'll catch everything. Why not? What kind of rat did you have? Um, it's been so long, I don't really remember. Um, the only thing I know is she was used as a breeder rat in this pet store, and she had probably the most calm and just loving personality. She was just so lovely. Um, I, I don't think I could have asked for a better first introduction to the world of small rodent pets. New Horizons track. You heard in the treehouse. Sounds like a soundtrack. A lot of acoustic solos. It's just a guitar. Yes, it, it sounded a little bit different. My pets are 10 now, 11 years old, so I grew up with mine as well. Sick for quite a while, having problems walking. Oh no. Spend as much time with them as possible. Of course. That's what I've been going through with Tiger recently. A campfire song. That's why I work is considering ordering a chinchilla. Oh, so cute. I've never had much experience with chinchillas, but they look very, very floppy. Oh, 
Oh, Snooty. Yeah, I grew up in a house that actually had a mouse problem. Um, so the two older cats that I mentioned that I grew up with, they were mouser cats. And they were really good at it. <laughs> and then, unfortunately, one of them, the girl, she ended up losing her teeth. Um, her, uh, the teeth that she would hold onto the mouse tail with or whatever, and she ended up dropping a lot of them. And It's kind of funny. <laughs> Yeah, Pepper. I grew up- it's, it's kind of unfortunate. I grew up with a lot of friends who saw rats and mice as nothing but vermin and, like, bad, dirty, like, you know, didn't want anything to do with them, were scared of them, and I'm like, they're lovely. <laughs> when you give them a chance, they are absolutely lovely. Of course, I'm not gonna go up to a rat in the subway system and try and befriend it, because that probably does have diseases. That was tiny. The shadow was tiny. And it didn't move fast at all. <laughs> but we caught it. That was easy. I remember it being really, really, really difficult. I'm just, yeah, I'm just gonna accept it. Just gonna accept it. Also, cool guy, welcome back. How are you doing? I'm gonna mark that one off my list. So the only one that we're missing now is the chambered Nautilus. I can't believe how good we're doing, you guys. This is crazy. No, throw it in the fire. <laughs> You're not sleeping on a fairy tale bench in my town. Oh, adorable. Got a cat, dog, guinea pig, rabbit, fish, and hermit crabs. That's cool. Um, is this it? Can't see what I'm aiming for, but oh wow, yeah, I'm not gonna catch whatever that is. <laughs> oh, Thrasher's best of luck getting that last fossil. I know it generally takes a long time. Did I catch another scallop? I did, yes. I did. Had a rat named Poppy Hood. Oh, gosh. Caspot. Uh, my rat's name, I've told this story before on stream, but my rat's name was Whiskey. Aptly named because uh, we had her out because she was so affectionate. She just loved being held. She liked to run around and be around us. And we had her out one day uh, when a family friend's boyfriend was over and he had a glass of whiskey and she ran right over to it and dunked her head in and was really going to down. <laughs> so she may have been alcoholic, but it's okay. She was fine. <laughs> Teddy bear hamsters? Yes. Yes, no, that's that's one of the types of hamsters I had. Her name was Princess. Um, the other type, I don't remember. He had much shorter, shorter hair. Oh, misguided am. One day, maybe? I don't know, maybe- I'm assuming you say I cry because you want one, but like... Some people just... Don't, and that's cool. Dumps head an alcohol drunken rat, lovely. She was- She was a sweetheart alcoholic, and that's fine. Whatever- whatever was good for her. No, she didn't get a lot. I- I don't think that's probably good for her. But... You want a doggo, misguided am? Is there a certain breed of doggo that you want? Because I think a lot of people have, like, a lot of people say, oh, I want a cat, but they don't necessarily know what type of cat they want. Whereas I ask, like, you know, what type of dog do you want? A lot of people have, like, that certain breed that they're like, yes, that one. I find my pet rock that ran away. You can keep it. <laughs> Samoid? Oh, gosh, yes. Uh, Ayumi? Am I saying your name right? Thank you very much for the follow. French Bulldogs? Oh. <laughs> Andrew, I read that, and then I read Random's reply, and I- I- gosh. That was funny. I was giggling before stream went live. <laughs> I couldn't go live until I was done laughing. Mink Hunes? Mink Hunes are, are gorgeous. They're a lot of work. Uh, they're- they're a lot of work. <laughs> An octopus, a boxer in June, eight years ago. It's gone by so quickly. Oh, <laughs> boxers are so bouncy and just lovely. Be minky at the end of the summer. I'm so excited. Oh, get ready to give all the brushies. So many brushies. Uh, TOG Phil, hello, how's it going? And thank you so much for the, uh, the follow, Phil. Is that how you want me to say your name or else you want me to say it? I know, random. It was funny. It was very funny. 
Huskies for first time dog owners are gorgeous but very difficult to train. There's definitely different types that would be better suited to first time owners. Um, it's somewhat same with cats, actually. <laughs> Not long fur, but a fat boy? Oh. <laughs> Never look for pure breeds, or at least I don't expect to get one. Yeah, um, and it, actually, pretty much all of my cats have been just mutts, <laughs> essentially. Um, the dogs I grew up with were not, but we had a friend who bred them, so that's pretty much why. You know what? I'm probably actually gonna take all of these home. So I can sell them. I can't believe we got the giant isopod that easily, though. Oh, Maxie. Dog is supposedly a German wired hair pointer, but I believe he may be a rat goat. <laughs> Savannah cats? Yes. Yes. Mike likes them as well. Half pitbull, half chihuahua. Ooh, that's a weird mix. Yeah, personally, if I'm gonna get a dog, uh, if I. For whatever reason, had to get a pure breed. Mike and I have already decided it's probably going to be some sort of standard poodle. Um, and for a long time, I had this kind of negative association with poodles where I thought that they always had like these really dumb haircuts. And no offense if your poodle has this haircut, where it's like shaved in certain locations and then puffy in others. But they're actually lovely, very intelligent dogs. Um, and so long as their hair is all the same length, I'm cool. <laughs> Oh, Ayumi, I'm so sorry to hear about your cat. I hope that you find them. Um, I don't know if you've already, you know, tried, but I have heard that if a cat goes missing, one of the best things you can do is put his or her litter box outside your front door if you live in, like, a house. Um, because the scent will probably draw them back home if they're lost. Just meet all the breeds. Oh, nice. <laughs> Bearded dragon, maybe a tarantula. Ooh, very cool. I, I'm not gonna lie, tarantulas would freak me out a bit, but the beard and dragon though. That's cool. Always get the shelter dogs? Yes, yes. That is probably the plan if Mike and I ever do get a dog, which we have already said we're not getting one unless we live in a house and or have a lot of time to take it out. Um, but if we do, we're just going to the Humane Society and getting a mutt of some sort. <laughs> Bernie Pooh, Bernie's Mountain Dog, Poodle Mix. I don't think I have, but I need to look that up. <laughs> it's for dog shows? Yeah, I know. Guys, am I going for the right size of shadow for the Chambered Nautilus? I still haven't found it. There's another, another giant isopod. <laughs> Bulldog Shih Tzu? No, I have not. I like bulldogs, though. Although, I don't- I'm- uh, Another good reason to be against getting specific breeds of dogs, like pure breeds, um, or pure bred, is dogs like bulldogs or pugs with that squished in nose. Um, a lot of the times they are born just straight up unable to breathe because of how poor the breeding has been. Um, and I'm not going to say if I see a dog that's a pug outside and it's in the rain that I'm not going to adopt it. I'm saying I'm not going to go out of my way to buy a puppy from a breeder and encourage it, if you know what I mean. Um, Chihuahuas or other little dogs. Pugs pugs have the same issue with the, with the eyes that kind of bulge out. They have a bad habit to fall out or get scratched out. Um, but yeah, I personally, I love... I love labs. I grew up with lab mixes. I like uh, golden golden retrievers because <laughs> they're big goofs and they're just sweethearts. Yeah, Andrew, I don't know what my luck is today. Means they can't breathe. Yeah, and you hear them snorting and like, yeah, it's kind of cute, but like, you know why. Eagle or boxers a beginner dog though? Yeah, boxers are a lot of work. They're big, they're higher energy. Um, I think beagles are very loud, aren't they? Uh, Gabby, hello, how's it going? Welcome back. Jeep is my favorite dog, corgis. Corgis are great, Mike and I have discussed. If going purebed route, a corgi, because it's, 
It's a- are you joking, game? <laughs> it's a- it's a- it's a little dog, a medium-sized dog, with a big dog mentality. <laughs> Dogs for people with disabilities and their golden retrievers. Oh, golden retrievers are just, they're known for being incredibly, incredibly just chill and loyal and patient. And maybe not always the most intelligent dogs, but they're lovely. Oh my goodness. Okay, Corgi, her name is Zelda. Oh, that's so cute. I grew up with a Corgi. Uh, that I knew from a family friend whose name was Foxy. Josh, welcome back. Tips for training a dog? Uh, persistence. Especially if you live with your family. Um, everyone should train it the same way. Um, but of course there's the basic commands that they should really know first before the fancy ones that don't really do anything. Um, and also, start very early. Start very early. There's a couple mistakes I always see um, with people who kind of own their dogs but don't really train them. Um, and they wonder why they have like food aggression or toy aggression. It's just training from a young age, like, you know, doing things that show the dog, hey, I'm in charge. <laughs> oh, Ember Meow, that's okay though. Um, I totally understand that. Um, I get nervous around big dogs if they come up and they're jumping on you. Um, small dogs, like, you know, they can't reach your face. Big dogs can't, and they might not al always mean to hurt, but they could. Pure big golden retriever who end up in a shelter. Oh, she likes my dog. She's so floppy. Name a dog if you got one? I don't really know. I don't really know. Mike and I, um, Mike's family has always had a dog named Tippy. Always. Um, Mike's mom grew up with a tippy, Mike grew up with a tippy, so he always says that he wants his future children to grow up with a tippy. I don't know if that'd be the first dog, but... Zeke sometimes loves a bit too hard, I feel that. Yeah, it's, it's a little bit intimidating for someone who's maybe not used to big dogs to come into a house and just have this big dog running up to you. But I, I know it just wants, it just wants to love you. <laughs> Really small big dog jumped for me and scratched me the other day, yeah. And like, they, they nine times out of ten, they don't mean it. They just want to love you, but... This one's moving differently. If I can catch it. Gosh darn it, I hate typing. You get stuck against that... Uh, divider. Oh, dagger, yeah. Okay, dog. Name it a poda. <laughs> he puts his butt in front of- Oh, Liz. No, that that's a sweetheart. That's a good boy. That's asking. <laughs> Newfoundland is 13. He just lays around. Gosh. Newfies are big dogs, too. <laughs> No, the dog didn't mean to, but she still did, and it still hurt. It's definitely her fault, but I try not to blame her. Yeah, exactly. It wasn't her attention. Pitbulls are banned in the UK. They're, uh, I think their breeding was also banned here a little while ago, but I don't think... I think dogs that were already here were not banned, if you know what I mean. But you still see pitbull puppies out, so... <laughs> Kept being brought back by previous owners because they didn't train them and it's annoying. Yeah. Yeah. I will just sit in front of you until you pet her. Yeah, Tiger. <sighs> Tiger loves people. He likes anyone who comes in the house. Anyone who is here, whether they're here to see me, my mom, anyone. Um, he, he, in his mind, they're here for him. He must be pet. Um, he's going to sit on your lap. He's going to make a big fuss of you. If there's someone who's coming in who maybe doesn't like cats, that's even better. Tiger will make you a cat person. <laughs> or at least he'll try his darndest to. How you been at pudding? How are you doing? Gosh, 
God, it's a scallop. I was hoping it was what we needed. I think I'm gonna give up on the chambered nautilus for today. I want to move on to something else here. Hi, this hello. How are you doing? I was having a dog. What type of dog did you have? Raiders, brothers, dog. That's what she bred. Her dogs to get him one again. My dog was part of the litter. Oh, I see. Just tiger me out the bathroom door for you to let him in. No, he pushes against the door and the door is like not very secure. So it rattles and it actually sounds like someone's trying to break it. <laughs> it's a bit scary. Um, he'll also run in ahead of you and then sit on the edge of the tub and then look back at you like, come on, come on. Come in, close the door, sit down. Take a seat in my office. <laughs> Uh, free aqua? Am I saying your name right? <laughs> Welcome on in here. Childhood cat was name was Tiger. Was he an orange tabby by any chance? Tiger's a tabby, but he's a... Uh... My tiger is a tabby, but he's a... Uh... Gray and black and white. <laughs> Turn tap on, let me drink. <laughs> Tiger owns a branch of Nook, wouldn't surprise me. <laughs> German Shepherd's Labs. Oh, Jack Russell's. That, that was the breed that I wanted as a child. Three cats now? Oh. <laughs> Regular brown tabby. Very cute, though. Dog scratches at my door to let him in, then steals my laundry and runs away. Tiger! Tiger got me in trouble a decent amount of times growing up. Um, because he liked to come into my room when I was little, and he'd pick up a stuffed toy and he'd drag it outside, even if it's bigger than him, and then he'd leave it there, and he'd keep doing it. He'd drag them and leave them all around the house. And then my mom kept telling me, pick up your toys, don't leave them outside, what are you doing? I told you to pick them up, and I'm like, I did. <laughs> uh, until one day I went away for camp for a week, and then my mom still found toys, and then she realized who was leaving them out. One is calm and one is extremely hyper. Oh boy. I've only ever heard of Jack Russell's being like really hyper and super happy but hyper. <laughs> Use the bathroom in the middle of the night, she'll not leave you alone or stop meowing. She's literally just mad at her. <laughs> oh, Lemonade, you know what? We're having the opposite problem then. <laughs> we'll bark if they want to a room. Gosh. See that? My cats are all pretty quiet. Tiger has a very quiet meow. Border Collie. And Border Collies are, again, they're usually high energy, aren't they? Maddie, a very fitting name. <laughs> I didn't praise Helix. Gosh darn it, you're right. That would have helped. <laughs> Come cuddle under the duvet. Oh, yeah. Uh, one of my other cats, Kiara, she likes to do that as well. She likes to burrow under things. Pet ducklings, but I don't want them to grow up. Adult dogs aren't. <laughs> See, it's good that you're you're not gonna follow through on that though, because there's a lot of people who adopt dogs or cats or anything really as babies, and they're like, oh, they're so cute, and then they grow up and then they get rid of them. So, uh, stays on the terrace if we're away. When I come home, he recognizes my steps and starts. Oh, <laughs> that's cute. Russian blue Siamese mix. Wow, that would be very pretty. I grew up with a uh, heart Siamese cat. He was pure white. Um, with bright yellow eyes. And he had the most distinctive Siamese yell. If you've ever heard a Siamese meow, you know it sounds different <laughs> to other cats. Um, it's very, very distinct. Um, no, I'm good. Oh, monkey. <laughs> yeah, my mom and- my mom actually, I think, this is just before we got Tiger, I want to say less than six months before we adopted Tiger, when I was eight. Um, my mom was out one day, uh, 
and it was super, super cold winter. I want to say it was maybe like January or February of that year. And um, she found a kitten with his paws almost frozen in the ice. She managed to get him out and she brought him home and he was the biggest sweetheart. And he was just this gray little tabby. My dad really did not want another cat. And this kitten managed to win over uh, my dad even. <laughs> but the issue was he was so small and I don't think he was ready to be away from his mom yet. So he wouldn't eat. So we had to bring him into the main society and they did eventually get him to eat. Um, and they did find a home for him. I really wanted him, but my dad was like, no. I think I also just sold the ship, ship cannon, but it's fine. <laughs> oh, Andrew, yes. If I ever get an orange tabby, 100%, its name is gonna be Simba. <laughs> Garage door, she'll wait by the front door and start to meow when we enter. Oh. Ah, oh, I, I caught it very easily, I, I don't know. Oh, whoop, you guys are just like, guarding here. And, uh, honey, hello, how are you doing? Welcome on in. I saw a main cute and I thought it was a line. <laughs> Maine Coons are massive. They could legitimately beat up a small dog if they wanted to. Like, they're just... Too large. Um, I'm just gonna make sure that all of these I actually already donated. I think I have, but I just wanna triple check. Class is off for like an hour and Twitch chats. <laughs> Text is not forgiving. No, I feel that. I'm actually, that's the one thing I dislike about streaming City Folk is because I have to sit further back for the uh, motion thing to pick up. Um, I can't see chat as well, so I'm constantly like, what are, what are you guys saying? <laughs> Could have lived if their mom didn't abandon them. Yeah, Tiger was abandoned as well. Um, we got Tiger from a uh, animal rescue group. Uh, one of the ladies in the group found his mom outside with these brand, brand, like, less than an hour old kittens. And she moved the mom and the kittens inside, and because that was very traumatic for this, this mother cat, she abandoned the kittens. So Tiger was raised uh, by hand. And I think that's half of the reason why he's so human-oriented. He's just... loves people. <laughs> it's going pretty good. It's going pretty good. Actually, I just realized it stopped raining. Latisa, you're finally playing Stardew... Or sorry, you finally started playing Stardew Valley. You're very addicted. I... yeah. Yeah, it's a huge time sink. I hope you're enjoying it, though. I really want to play Stardew. But the two towns I have active right now are ones that I'm playing either multiplayer with people, and I have to wait for people, be online or I'm doing it on stream <laughs> so I don't really I don't really have a town to play in by myself right now he's listening <laughs> okay Oh, no. Nope. We're just gonna sell off all this. Monkey, no worries. You have a fantastic rest of your day. Started on Switch because I didn't like playing it on my PC, which is much better handheld. No, I feel that Stardew actually fits really well handheld. I know a lot of people dislike using a controller with it. Um, I personally don't mind, but... He's selling out to JoJo. It's okay, Pepper. Everyone's been busy. But the map is slightly bigger. I've had a couple of people actually email me. Shout out to those two people, by the way. I'm not going to say names just in case, but uh, I've had a couple of people email me being like, Crystal, look at this, and they'll show me proof of like, it was two different emails from two different people, and they pretty much did a, said the exact same thing, which is it's slightly bigger than the New Leaf map. And they like were like estimating via house size, and it was some intense, intense math going on. Use the USB controller when you play on PC. Yeah, that's what I do as well. Uh, Spartan, hello. How's it going? Those emotes are so cute. 
I recognize that Hylian Z-Mutt's in there for sure. Who else have we got? Who else? Very nice. So cute. Ah, dagger. Maybe we'll switch over to City Folk? We could do that. Or do you guys want to continue trying for fish, maybe? In memory for a little while and then switch over. Oh, nice, Ark. <laughs> Wait. What am I doing? I'm trying to pay off a home loan. Jeez. City Folk? <laughs> CC. We could do City Folk. We could switch over. It just means I have to go on another quick break to switch on over and get everything set up, if that's cool with everyone. Can't wait for July so you can catch the scorpion. I'm hoping it goes as well as the tarantula did, because that actually wasn't that bad. It's okay, Andrew. I think maybe every stream, maybe every other stream even, we can do encyclopedia stuff. So we'll do like, we did diving stuff today, we'll do bugs next time, we'll do fish the other time. Um, so we can put down... There we go, just to make it an even number. Hey, folk. Oh, by the way, I didn't tell you guys this yet. I guess I could tell you later, but I'll tell you now. Um, I played on City Folk yesterday just to make sure that our, all of our flowers were still watered and stuff like that. And we have a new villager. <laughs> um, I don't really know if I like them, but we got a new villager. <laughs> Ripberry, no it's not. We're actually about to switch on over to City Folk here, so we're like halfway through. Is it Bobbert? No, I like Bob. <laughs> but yeah, give me give me a couple minutes here. We're gonna go on another BRB. If you guys are uh heading out, if you're just here for New Leaf, no worries. But if you guys are gonna hang out and chill with us in City Folk, that's cool as well. Um if you guys are heading out though and you enjoyed it, I you know, maybe leave a follow if you enjoyed hanging out. Wanna come back? Uh, is it Tavi? Is it Cat? I'm not telling you guys. You guys will see in a couple minutes. <laughs> um, but yeah, give me like five-ish minutes, maybe a little bit more, and I will be right back with some city folk.
Hello there you guys, so sorry about the delay there. Um, took a little bit longer than I thought to set this up. So, right up there, I've added in our villagers. And you can see who our new one is. I think I'm missing someone. Am I missing someone? Who else do we got? <laughs> um, but welcome back you guys. This layout, I'm not sure if I'm really digging the layout. I'm probably gonna change it, but for now it's good. Um, also, you know, I just remember I gotta do something. 